Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again, man. <laughs> Salute to everybody up in here, man. Appreciate y'all rocking with your boy. Damn. D. P. O. V. This is where I get my point of view on anything I want to talk about, man. And today we're going to talk about some sneakers, man. Because if y'all don't know, I am a sneakerhead. I cover a lot of, I have a sneaker channel that has one, 128K subs and a whole bunch of other shit. So we're going to cover a little bit of sneaker politics. Now, if you don't know the behind, if you don't know the backstory to this beef, go watch my other videos to keep it simple. Nike trademarked Jordan 1, Kukai, and a lot of other people, uh, you know, were uh, imitating or mocking up or making shoes that look like Jordan 1. Jordan 1 said, stop it. But Kukai kept going. Omni and Kukai have a little thing going back and forth about sneakers and a whole bunch of other stuff. It, 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 it's just a long story, okay? If you know, you know. If you don't, you don't. If you don't know, go to my past videos about this situation. Kukai and Ami. Ami or Omni. No disrespect, but I'm a little illiterate, so I mispronounce people's names all the time. But here we go. We got some new information. And shout out to uh, Ami and the Hellcat. I'm actually going to buy one of these. But I just want to buy this one. I don't want the other colorways. But no, no, no. Oh, hold on. Is this different? Oh, this is orange. I thought that was red. But I'm going to buy the Chicago, the Chicago colorway when this comes out. Uh, I think it has a pre-order on the other ones because I'm a content creator. And this would be this would make amazing content, especially knowing the backstory. So I want to see this shoe. I want to see if it's good material. I'm I'm actually going to purchase this shoe. He's doing pre-orders, not on this, but um. I think he has pre-orders on some shoes right now. So y'all can pre-order his shoes if you want to, you know. Uh, check out his website. He has the shadows on pre-order right now, but I don't want the shadows. I want the Chicago's. But we have a little situation. So let's just run through it. I am eating my dinner. So if y'all hear me smacking in the background, it's because I'm eating my dinner. Just got done working out, lifting weights and shit. So if I'm smacking, shit, deal with it. All right, so here we go. Now, if you can't see this right here, it says your content has been removed. Your remo we removed your content because a third party reported that the infringes, infringes their intelligent and in intellectual <laughs> property rights. All right. Uh, post remove IP violation. Uh, the party reported that your content infringes their copyright. So it looks like by Cool Kai. It says Cool Kai sent the copyright, his email address. Oh, his sneaker lawyer. I guess that's his lawyers. Copyrighted Ami's photo. So, so Kai and the sneaker law firm been taking photos down saying, copyright, bro, you stole from Nike. We about to turn up on you. Oh, shit. Ami is already a petty ass nigga. Like, <laughs> we see how petty it can get. And cool Kai, I, I think you about to make him turn up even more. That's just my opinion. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, I think he's about to get real petty with you now. Like, extremely petty. Uh, so, my lawyer will deal with yours. Now your rat ass got it messed up. Since you want to play the rat games, we can all get Nike involved. Oh, shit. Oh, sh see, this is what I'm... Fuck. Cool card, man. I, I ain't gonna lie. You should just left it alone. I mean, I know he's taking... A lot of stuff from you. He's taking your model. He's taking your lightning bolt. But technically, you took the lightning bolt from somebody. Else. It's it's this is a very sticky and confusing situation. But Kuka, it seems like he did a copyright strike on Ami's um, picture to get it removed. But now it seems like he's about to turn up, and. Uh, 
I don't want to see this go down. I, I'm not going to lie, but. Ah, oh, shit. It's about to get messy. Uh, Kai, you're stealing from Nike and you have the audacity to claim a copyright. You are tripping. You're barking up the wrong tree now. Now I'm going to make sure you can't sell this is the third time you tried to stop me. My shoe is custom and it's not an Air Jordan 1 like you're selling. So once again, this is him. Damn. Omni Hellcat and Bandman Kevo. I don't, I don't know who that is. Our project to make 1.8 million, 1, 1. 8 million off of sneakers. That's dope, man. Throw on yourself. Okay, I don't really care about that shit. Uh, I'm mean, the Hellcat. Take it. Can't take it down for. Oh shit. Can't take it down for copyright made by Black's Graphics. And there's no. And God damn it. And this is no way his his photo. I don't see any Kukai trademarks. Oh shit. Here we go. Yo, Kai, don't you got the streets? And you out here telling? Hold on. Come on, Kai. All right, it's time to eat my food. Yo, Kai, stop telling Kai. Yo, Kai, don't you got the streets? And you out here telling? Come on, Kai. You out here telling and you selling Nikes, Kai? Bad move, brother. Bad move. What he just did, it's like a nigga selling heroin on a corner. And we're selling legalized marijuana and him calling the cops on us. Like, bro... Our shoe is completely legal. No Nike panels, no nothing. And you selling fucking bootlegs. Cuz, like, how you going? Bro, you weird, bro. How you got the streets and you fucking telling like that, cuz? Bro, your reputation is about to get ruined, cuz. Real shit. That is the weirdest shit I've ever seen anybody on Instagram ever do, bro. That shit is weird, Kai. You a fucking weirdo. How you call it? Then you got the sneaker law firm. That bum ass fucking lawyer. Man, we're going to chew y'all niggas up. You are the weirdest nigga on the internet. Talk about niggas are selling Photoshop pictures don't get got. Bro, you're the same person that did four or five pre-orders back to back to back. Then you went and took their money to, to fund your pop-up shops. You fucking scam artists people still waiting there's thousands of people that still didn't get their shoes from you what are you talking about we just did the halloweens last week and we're gonna drop them and in, in, in the beginning the first two weeks of next month and we just took them we just took pre-orders on them my shit's almost we're already in production what are you talking about why because of the shadow picture bro we drop our shadows we, we take pictures of our shadows in three days and we'll put up the real shadow pictures so you can see how banging they look Bro, you's a weirdo, bro. You selling Nikes, bro. And, bro, you don't, you don't want to start this war, bro. You really don't, cuz. You really don't, cuz. You're the biggest scam artist on the fucking internet. That's all you do, and you block hella people, cuz. Stop it. Stop it. What it is, you scared. You scared that we're getting all this attention. You scared that we selling like a motherfucker. You scared. You scared shitless. You scared. And you can't take the heat. You scared. I told you, leave my production alone. We good. We don't got to go public with this. We will never fight about this again. You decided to take down the cool waves. Now you mad that I got the boat. Nigga, let's, let me tell you something. You seen I already had boats. The only reason why I didn't release the boats was out of respect for you. And guess what? You deserve no respect, cuz. So you're going to sit, sit there and say, I own this. I own the rights. Copyright of what, bro? You're still in Nikes, bro. What the fuck are you talking about? My shoe got panels, all different panels. And guess what? You're copying my shoe. Oh, shit. You're taking my shoe and copying it right now as we speak. What are you talking about, cuz? You need to get your life together, bro. Stop stop telling. That What you just did was just telling on people, bro. I told you, Kai, we're going to outsell you. I told you that. I said, Kai, we're going to sell them cheaper than you. We got you by $100, bro. No, about $120. I told you. I told you. I told you it was going to happen. You didn't believe me. You kept fucking with me, and guess what? Now you got what you deserve. Now you out here want to tell. You started the fight and want to tell. Like, nigga, you ain't had to stop my production of my shoes, cuz. You didn't have to, you ain't had to do that.
You ain't had to do it. But guess what? You did it. Now I got the boats. They're mine. And we're selling. I don't care about your fans come over and talk shit here. But nigga, you're telling. So now you got to put a little rat emoji on the side of your shoes. Because that's what you represent. Oh, we're about to get into you, bro. I got to go see my lawyers in the morning. We're about to dig a nice little hole for you because put you right where you belong at. Yo, reload the hookahs. Woo. This nigga got hookahs now. <laughs> hey, man, this nigga's a hustler. Yeah, y'all see it. As soon as the shipment came in, threw one right in my truck. They got hookahs now? They got me said, no, nah, man. No. Nah. I said, yeah, man. Yeah. Oh, man. So it looks like um, the beef is not over yet with Kukai and uh, Ami. Oh, shit. It looks like it's about to get messy. It looks like they about to get lawyers involved. It looks like it's going to get real messy, man. I wish it didn't come to this. You know what I'm saying? Because I support both of them. I'm going to buy Omnis. Yeah, look at me. Look at me. Uh, look, look, look. <laughs> oh, shit. Look at Nugget acting like he broke with a... Oh, shit. Wrinkled where? Wrinkled yeah. there. Nugget acting like you broke with a what? All right, man. I got my hands all fucked up from eating this shrimp and crawfish and shit, but it look like it's gonna get spicy, man. It look like it's gonna get spicy like this potato and these shrimps that I'm eating. I wish it didn't have to come to this because I honestly don't like when lawyers get involved. But, you know. Uh, Kukai. Hey, Kukai! You owe me some goddamn shoes, man! You told me you was gonna send me some shoes. Where they at? Kukai, answer your DM, bro. I need those Chicago's, man. You said you're gonna send me some shoes, man. You been getting ghost on me, man. <laughs> nah, but I support Kukai. I fuck with Kukai. I, I, I bought some shoes from him. He has amazing the products. Everybody is entitled to their own opinion. If you rock with Kukai, you, you, you rock with Kukai. If you rock with Omni, you rock with Omni. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to lie. I am going to buy his. See, the, the reason why I want to buy his shoes so I can compare. So I can literally compare the two. You know what I mean? I want to compare the material, the leather, the stitching, what's the differences, you know what I'm saying? I'm a content creator, so I'm going to purchase this for content, you know what I'm saying? So when this shoe comes out, I'm going to buy it. I like it. it. It looks good, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going to buy it, do a review, do a comparison, and do all that good stuff, you know what I'm saying? Because I am a content creator. So, and I fuck with Kai too. Cool Kai too, you know? Hey, Cool Kai, man, you owe me some shoes, man. Where's my goddamn shoes? You said you gonna send me some shoes. What's up? What's up? I need them shoes, man. Answer your DMs. <laughs> but anyway, man, it's your boy, Deb D. I'm signing out. Y'all y'all, let me know in the comments how do y'all feel, man? How do y'all feel about this whole situation? Is It seems like it's gonna get sticky. It seems like it's gonna get messy. Seems Seems like he's about to get his lawyers involved. Seems like there's going to be a lot of legal battles going on right now. So I wish it did not come to this. I wish they could both, you know what I'm saying? I wish they could both come to, you know, an agreement without lawyers, without fucking lawyers. Because that shit, ugh. I don't agree with it, but, you know, it is what it is, man. You know, people got to handle it how they handle it. So y'all leave a comment down below and y'all let me know how y'all feel about this, man. It's about to get crazy. It's your boy DMD signing out, baby. Peace.